Calculating percentages can be tricky to master. Try out these tips to see if they can help you to calculate percentages. In this video, I will show you the process for calculating percentages. Once you understand the process, you will be able to calculate these types of sums mentally. What is 15% of 60? Now, to work out 15% of 60, you need to understand what 100% of 60 is. 100% is the whole number. So, 100% of 60 is 60. Next step, what is 50% of 60? Or, what is half of 60? Or, what is 60 divided by 2? The answer is 30. Next step, what is 10% of 60? Or, what is 60 divided by 10? The answer is 6. What is 5% of 60? You already know that 10% of 60 is 6. So, to work out 5% of 60, you need to half 6, which is 3. Right, let's recap. So, 100% of 60 is 60, 50% of 60 is 30, 10% of 60 is 6, and 5% of 60 is 3. So using those steps, you can calculate 15% of a number, so 15% of 60 is 9. It is important that you understand the process for calculating percentages. This will help you to work out percentage sums mentally. What is 15% of 40? Let's go through the process again. We need to know what 100% of 40 is. And 100% equates to the whole number. So, 100% of 40 is 40. What is 50% of 40 or what is half of 40 or what is 40 divided by 2? The answer is 20. What is 10% of 40? Or what is 40 divided by 10? The answer is 4. What is 5% of 40? We already know that 10% of 40 is 4. If we halve 4, we will get 5% which is 2. So let's recap. 100% of 40 is 40. 50% of 40 is 20. 10% of 40 is 4. And 5% of 40 is 2. So 15% of 40 is... What is 15% of 70? Let's go through this process for the final time. What is 100% of 70? 100% equates to the whole number. So, the answer is 70. 100% of 70 is 70. What is 50% of 70? Or, what is half of 70? 
What is 70 divided by 2? The answer is 35. What is 10% of 70? Or what is 70 divided by 10? The answer is 7. What is 5% of 70? We already know that 10% of 70 is 7. What is half of 7? The answer is 3.5 or 3.5. So let's recap. 100% of 70 is 70, 50% of 70 is 35, 10% of 70 is 7, and 5% of 70 is 3.5. So 15% of 70 is 10.5. We hope you found this useful. Be resilient and keep practicing. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you in the next video.